Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. This video is going to be a step-by-step -step guide on how to buy and sell NFTs on a PancakeSwap decentralized NFT marketplace. I'm going to show you everything you need to know. So sit back and relax. Let's get started. So to get started with regards to buying NFTs, you want to head over to PancakeSwap.finance. Once you're here, you want to click on connect here or you can use this button here. But I'm going to click this one because the website gets updated frequently. So this button may not be here by the time you're watching this video. So I'm going to click on connect. Here we're presented with uh, various options. You can connect your MetaMask, for example. If I click on that, you can see my wallet is now connected. I'm going to disconnect it. Let me show you another way that you can connect your wallet. I'm going to click on connect and connect with your wallet connect. For example, here I want to connect my trust wallet. So I'm going to bring my trust application here and click on connect wallet as well. Make sure that you want settings, then click new connection. From here, you want to scan this QR code. You can see here it says, do you want to connect with PancakeSwap? Then I'm going to click connect. And immediately my wallet is now connected so after you've got your wallet connected as you can see i am connected here on top you want to make sure that you hover over to nft right here on top go to nft then click on collections from here you can see a wide variety of nfts that you can obviously buy and sell on the platform at this moment only pancake bunnies are available but more other nfts will come in the future over here i'm under items then i'm going to click on trade from here, you can see a wide variety of NFTs that are available on the platform and you can also sort them out by rarity. That's how they are sorted here. If I click on this icon, I'll see the cheapest ones. If I click it again, then I'll see the most expensive one. Take for example, this first one here, you can see the rarity count on top and the percentage. It's costing around 292 BNB. I'm going to click on it and you can see how much that is in US dollars. Actually, this NFT now that i've seen how expensive it is i'm just gonna call it a picture this picture cost more than 1 million rand which is crazy if you wanted to buy you obviously buy here but anyway you can also just tap on this icon so let me go ahead and buy this one oops i don't have enough funds so what i need to do is hover over on my wallet here and just load funds i'm gonna click on that in the beginning of this video, I connected my trust wallet. However, my trust wallet is also linked with my MetaMask extension, which means my trust wallet and my MetaMask is basically just one wallet. So now I need to load funds on this account in order for me to buy this NFT. I'm going to click on this address to copy it. I'm on a Binance machine here for cheaper transaction fees. And I'm going to head over to Binance. On Binance, I'm on a crypto withdrawal tab. I've already selected BNB as that's the currency you'll need in order for you to buy it and sell these NFTs. So I'm going to paste the wallet here and you can see the wallet already picks up that this is a Binance Smart Chain wallet, uh, which is really good. You want to make sure that you're on the right network, otherwise you lose your funds. If you don't already have your Binance account to buy your BNB, I'm going to leave it in the description of this video so you can go ahead and pick up that link and obviously some other links as well that will show you how to buy your BNBs. So I'm going to click on Max and I'm going to withdraw. I know everything is correct, so I'm going to confirm. Now, if we click on our extension, you can see our funds are there. It took about a couple of minutes. You want to make sure that you on NFTs. Under NFTs, you want to make sure you're on collections. Under collections, you want to make sure that you on items. Under items, you can sort out by the lowest price or the most recent. I'm going to click on lowest price because I just want to show you guys how to actually buy these NFTs. I'm actually waiting for the Pancake Squad NFTs. Um, but I'm going to show you how to actually buy this. So let's look at the prices. These ones, I've already have this one. Um, so this one is 0 0.25257. So this is the cheapest one. This one cost about $22 and it looks nice. This cost about $64. Let's buy this one. I'm going to click on this one and I'll click on the first one here. So I'm going to click on buy and we can see that it's costing us $22.77, um, which is okay. So I'm going to click on checkout and I'm going to confirm this. So 
So after trying this for several times, I realized on the Chrome extension, it wasn't going to work. Then I changed browsers. So immediately when I switched browsers, then I was able to execute the trade. And I want to buy this one. I'm going to click on buy. Check out. Confirm. Now you can see on my wallet, on the other hand, on the trust wallet, uh, if I confirm this, everything should be good. Your NFT has been sent to your wallet. So now I have two options. I can view it on the scan or I can just close this. But anyway, I'm just going to close this. So now these are my NFTs. Now I can go and click on this NFT specifically and I can now decide to sell this NFT or transfer it to a separate wallet, for example. If you want to see your NFTs on your wallet, you need to come to your wallet or your trust wallet and click on collections. From here, you need to click on pancake banners, which is the category of my NFTs. And this is the NFTs that we just bought this one here. Now I can decide to send it or sell it. Now I'm going to sell it. I'm going to click on the browser here and I'm going to list it. I'm going to list it for 0 0.053. No, 0 0.05. I'm listing it for about 24 US dollars. I bought it for 22. So um, just for the sake of this example, I'm going to click on enable listing. And confirm that on my trust wallet. Now my NFT is out on the market, anyone can buy it. So I had to come back and adjust the price so that I can sell this NFT and obviously close everything within this video. Once your NFT is sold, your funds will be sent directly to your wallet. I hope you find this video helpful. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. I'm also gonna be releasing my own NFT collections probably on a pancake swap marketplace so be on the lookout for that in fact if you are a subscriber to this channel you stand a very good chance to get you know your hands on my nft collection i'm gonna be dropping them to you as my subscribers for free so make sure you subscribe and turn on post notifications and be on the lookout for my nft collections i'm still in a design phase i'm doing some renderings and testing some you know concepts as well it has taken a long time for me to actually design and execute these nfts uh, or rather this idea that i have in my head and just articulate it on the paper so be on the lookout for that and obviously subscribe to our post notifications help us reach that hundred thousand subscribers we're still very 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 far from that but i believe we'll get there eventually so i'll see you in the next one goodbye for now peace